Let's take a look at your future track as we make our way into Friday morning. We will have a couple of clouds around. I still think we'll see some sunshine though, but the clouds will gradually fill in, especially along and west of I-35 by lunchtime. Maybe still a few peaks of sun east of I-35, but then we all get into the clouds as we head into Friday afternoon by 5 o'clock, and there could be a couple of sprinkles around by then. I do think there will be scattered showers as we make our way from Friday at 5 o'clock through midnight Saturday. And it looks like the best chances will be across the eastern half of the area. That's where the moisture will be deepest. And we may even see a few isolated thunderstorms as we head towards 6 o'clock Saturday morning, especially along and east of I-35 before that clears out as we make our way into the afternoon hours. So we will continue to track the potential for a little rainfall out there, but tonight should be quiet and mostly clear again. Not quite as cold as last night down into the low to mid 30s for us, and we should see those temperatures make their way up into the upper 50s and lower 60s as we head through the afternoon hours on Friday. So again, with the clouds, that will help to temper temperatures just a bit here across the area. Your 10 day forecast 59 degrees for a high on Friday, 20% chance of a shower. That'll be late in the day as those clouds continue to increase. Saturday, showers in the morning, clearing out in the afternoon, a high of 60 degrees. Sunday at 63, and then we're looking at upper 60s and lower 70s. Monday, Tuesday into Wednesday. But just in time for Christmas, it does appear that a pretty strong cold front will be making its way into the area. That's going to drop us down to 51 degrees on Christmas Eve. And how about this? Christmas Day, 48 degrees. And there's going to be some pretty chilly air just to our north. Does it make it this far south? Sometimes the models underestimate that. So we're going to be tracking this forecast closely as it could even be a little bit colder than what you see here as we head toward Christmas. Then the weekend after maybe an isolated shower as temperatures begin to modify just a bit. But we do have a chance for rain as we head into Friday evening into Saturday morning.